What is going on? Philip G in my dorm thought I can take a little break from my studying to talk about this huge reveal of this awesome freaking trailer. Dude, I finished up literally with my friend, our dis uh, Discord call talking about school and everything, and I get bang! WandaVision? WandaVision? Are you kidding me, dude? I got so hyped because we haven't gotten that much Disney Plus show material. And then when I freaking saw this trailer, oh my gosh, my comic book nerdy senses went up. Because the only YouTube people that caught the Easter egg, I predicted this show would literally have House of M Easter eggs. And I saw it on that wine bottle. You know what I'm talking about. But the whole like... When the Mr. Hard, that, that family scene, that dinner scene, then had the reverse with the wine. And I paused. I'm like, holy crap. Are you kidding me? House of M? And nobody caught it. Nobody caught it. That's the sad part. I was so sad that nobody else caught it. Just me. I'm just like, oh. And I had to pause. I'm like, wait a minute. That went by way too quickly. I mean, the Easter eggs there. It's so comic booky. And it's so nerdy, but at the same time, it's weird, it's strange. And everyone's trying to predict, what is this show about? Is this in Wanda's head? Is this multiverse? Because, as Kevin Feige quoted, Wanda's getting more powerful. Endgame was just a showcase of what she did. She made Thanos tap out in wrestling terms. And he was like, just rain freaking fire, I can't deal with her. Because Wanda in the comics grows to a point... Well, she just needs to say the words, no more mutants. Destroys the X gene, or majority of mutant population, like the mutant gene. That's how strong she eventually becomes. She just has to say those words. She goes to a level that her powers grow exponentially. In the MCU, it's no difference. You see her rage, how pissed she is when Vision dies. And people are saying to me, why does this Vision have Infinity Stone in his head? We still don't know. Because it's, it's transitioning to these different comic booky moments, maybe multiverse. Because we see Wanda's kids. In the comics, both of these two have similar powers to Quicksilver and similar powers to um, Wanda. I don't remember their names. They're, if you look it up, you'll see what I'm talking about. But when they held the babies, I was like, oh my gosh. Oh, Wanda's twins, dude. It was so good. Even it was 1 minute 21 seconds, I can't believe just how much stuff they put in. They jammed it in, dude. It was so nice just to see, especially like that one scene with Agnes just basically telling Vision, yeah, you're basically dead. And like Vision being like, wait, what are you talking about? <laughs> and like her laughing because no one knows. I know kind of what they're going with because Agnes in the comics was someone who, well, like, it's kind of explained that Scarlet Witch has, like, more of a... I mean, yeah, she's been considered a mutant, quote-unquote. But, like, she had more, like, magic-like powers, if that makes sense to everybody. Her powers are more magic-based. And Agnes was considered this person who helped her channel these this magic inside of her, if that makes sense to her. That's why it's kind of great they brought this character, Agnes. Because uh, in the comics, that's her role, because... Wanda's powers are both her um, mutation and literally magic. That's just kind of crazy because the MCU is kind of inspiring from them. And that's why in the trailer we see Vision dressed up in his comic book counterpart. And we see Wanda dressing up in her costume. This, this is going to be a tough show. But I'm excited just to see that trailer made me so like, ugh, I miss this. I miss this because I've been waiting for the MCU to pounce on this stuff so for so long because we've been just dragged down by the general comic book stuff but with wandavision we're now going into the comic book territory which i've been waiting for for so long but other than that i mean from what we've dissected from that trailer we are it's gonna get wacky multiversey if that makes sense to you guys we're gonna be getting into some really weird stuff and i am hyped but um, if anything else, I mean, nothing else to say. I mean, uh, I got to go back to studying. 
but hope everyone is safe at home, e-learning or whatever you're doing, and have a great rest of your day.